hi guys welcome to my channel and welcome to this special video if you have been following me on instagram you'll know by now that i was at the dream moments with mo abudu which was held on the 28th of january 2019 and i had an amazing time i learned a lot so you guys have been asking me if i filmed the event yes i did film a bit not everything but like i filmed a bit of it and this video is a combination of the speakers that inspired me during the event it's going to be an inspiring video and i hope you enjoy it so just keep watching you have to be really intentional about what you're doing and association is also very it's part of personal branding so i put it on my linkedin because people are going to see you on a poster with high-flying executives that already says something about me as i told you i'm going to keep telling you about what i do so that you actually understand how you can switch yourself so you're thinking about your audience and my audience where all the executives are is my linkedin not on, on my instagram my instagram are my friends i want to see what i'm wearing so i put it where exactly where i want all those executives who are following me where, where I know that they're going to stay. So you do need to know your audience, you need to know where to put your content. Now, what is your X factor? What is it about you that's going to make somebody hire you, want to work with you, associate with you? And what makes you reliable, what makes you trustworthy? How do you prove that? What's the, what evidence do you have? Now, we'll get to the evidence shortly. Now, when you start, um, after you ask yourself, yourself all those questions, then you start to think, you start thinking about putting a profile together. So, um, are you going to put together a bio? If you're a digital marketing expert, are you going to start writing the sort of clients? The build might not start to show up very quickly. However, in most cases, it takes time for Google and other search engines to index some of these profiles that you create. Typically, it takes two to six weeks. Now, that doesn't mean that the new LinkedIn account or the new account you created is not going to show up, but search engines are dependent on content. What are you sharing? Don't leave the profiles. Share every stage of your career, whatever you are achieving, even the little things that you think are so small, share. Sometimes you're, encour you're even encouraging another person and inspiring another person to do better, right? So always make sure you share because these search engines won't appear with your online profiles if you don't put content on them. Now, this takes us to our next phase. You have a good online profile, you say you're this, you say you're that. You have to build credibility. You know, people need to trust you, you need to be trustworthy. Um, I think I already touched this. You have to start to share your work, share your thoughts and ideas about issues relevant to you. And so for example, if you're a photographer and you have an Instagram account or you have those different apps for showing your photography and there's only one shoot, you only have one shoot on your profile, I can't decide if I want to use you or not because I need to see that you can do wedding shoots, you can do fashion photography, you can do product shoots, you can do this, you can do that. So you have to make sure that you consistently share your work. Sometimes it, you may think it's time consuming, but you don't even know how that thing that you're sharing can be connecting into a potential client. So it's just so important to ensure that you share all that content. Okay. Now, sometimes when we share these, um, have all these nice things going on, you're sharing your work, you of course need to start networking with people. Now you need to, this will help you expand your audience. In terms of outreach, you need to start reaching out to new people who you think will be interested in your work. Sometimes, if you have a great personal brand, people will actually respond to you when you reach out to them because they can see, they can, they can see that this person has something great going on. So when you reach out to them, they don't hesitate to reach out as well. Right? Remember, it's all in stages. If you have that, um, if you're building, you're building, you're building, you get to the stage where you can start to speak to industry leaders, and it's okay, they will respond to you. And then remember, content is so, so important. Once you start to do these things, if you own a company, you're sharing the success of your company, that's how interviews start to happen. I remember the first time um, I 
received an award. It was SME 100 for kilo 125. I was so confused. I was like, how did you find me? I don't know what is this, whatever, whatever. But these are things that start to happen to you. And then sometimes you realize that. So sometimes some people are nominated for an award or something. And you see a lot of Nigerians in the comments like, oh my God, it's always the same people. It's this, 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 that. Those are the people that share what they do. Those are the people that they can find. If you're doing amazing work and nobody knows, well, only you. You're the only one that knows. Nobody else is about you, right? Also, for people that work in companies, it's like, oh, how do I share my work? Do you deliver results for your organization? Okay, so share it. When you want to go to the next organization, they're going to recognize what you've done and the impact that you've made where you already were. The chief answer for me is the God factor. Yeah. There is nothing that I have done. There is no project I have started. There is no project I'm in the middle of. I put in front, center, everywhere. You know, so it's important for you to decide on how, what role you want God to play in your life if you believe in God. I'm not here to persuade you either way. But I'm saying that it's something that has worked for me in my life. I've seen the testimonies that have abound in my life and it can only be but by His grace. And I know that's because before I embark on any journey, I ask I actually listen, then I ask, then I request, then I do, then I ask again. And then when you can start to see the signs of success and the things that you've asked for becoming a reality that you knew are actually more or less miraculous in your life, then you know it's simply by His grace. So I just wanted to share that with you. I'm sure we all have a Bible near us so we can find one. It works for me. Who knows? It will work for you also. Now, before we go into the Q&A, you've heard a lot today, and I have to say a big, big thank you. I've had a lot of bills that I have to pay, I've dealing with people that are driving me nuts, and I'm just like, I have to be somewhere. Sometimes when I didn't really just go to my watch, but I'm like, please, I'm going to do that, I'm just going to wear sweats. Then I'll not remember. You know, after I put on my wig, and I'll brush it, I'm like, ah! You're looking okay now, you're looking okay. You know, I'll not put on a dress,
It's unbelievable. 4 p.m. and you have whiskey and all these things. No, it is just a disaster waiting to happen. The cigarette companies have left England and all that. They can't, they can hardly smoke in public. So they're all here. So they're going to the university campuses and they're giving you free cigarettes and they're giving you alcohol free for parties and so on. You've got to be careful. It is liver disease waiting to happen and cancer waiting to happen. For the future. If you don't find a way to make money when you're asleep, you will be working till you die. So we need to go to bed at night before you wake up a dividend dropped into your account. And the next day, rent dropped into your account. And the book royalties that you wrote, the book you wrote last year, dropped into your account. It's so important. Interest income, dividend income, royalties, all those things. Develop your knowledge. We've talked.